BGMC. The biblical truth lives here. scriptures foretold of the anointed one, Yeshua HaMashiach. The Messiah Yeshua came to call the people back to the truth of his word and to follow that righteous path. Yeshua then called Jewish men to be his disciples and after his death and resurrection those Jewish men told the world about the Jewish Messiah. Now after 2,000 years Beth Goyim Messianic congregation has that same calling of those Jewish men telling all people, both Jew and Gentile, about the proper ancient path, teaching the Route 66 King's Highway from Genesis through to Revelation, and how you need and can get back to the proper roots of the faith and a closer walk with God. Now, let's hear the message. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Let's start with the Hebrew class. Vamos a comenzar con las clases de Hebreo. Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for this day. Thank you for your blessings for this uh, new day that we just start. Um, we ask you for protection, blessings, um, knowledge from your Torah, from your Lashona Kodesh, the holy language, and um, especially for, for us to learn that beautiful language, the Hebrew, and be able to read your Torah, your Tanakh, and obey it accordingly to exactly what you say, not our own interpretation. B'Shem Yeshua HaMashiach. Amen. Okay. So here, a kid, we have a story. Okay, we got to read this story. Vamos a leer esta historia. Okay. And he says, Sipur. Okay, Sipur is, is a story, okay, historia. Okay. Entonces, vamos a leerla. Let me give you a hint here. A hint. Every time that you see a number right here, for example, right here, number one. Is going to the meaning is going to be on the other side. Cada vez que veamos una palabra con un número, okay, el significado es estar del otro lado, okay. Pues vamos a leer. Let's let's read. I'm gonna read the whole. I'm gonna read the whole story in Hebrew, slow, and then you only have to follow. And after that, we're going to break it down. Voy a leer toda la historia en hebreo, poco al despacio, y después vamos a, pues, a desglosar qué hemos leído. Okay. Si pur. Hacheder sheli gadol. Hacheder. Sheli, Delet, Halon, Kise, Ve, Shulchan. Bacheder, Sefer, Gadol. Ba, Sefer, Sipur Gadol Amishpacha Lo Bacheder Aach Lo Bacheder Hahot Lo Bacheder Ani Bacheder Okay. Who understands? Who understands? 
I'm just playing. Let's break it down. Vamos a explicar ahora. Ok, Sipur means story. Sipur significa historia. Ok. Hajeder. Ha is the. Ok. Ha is the. Ha significa el asloso o él. En este caso. Heder. Heather means room or bedroom. So Heather significa habitación o cuarto. Ok. Shell. Shell. Let me bring my pencil here. Just give me one second. Ok. Let me see. Shell, only shell, solo shell, it means property. So it's something that it could be yours. Es algo que puede ser tuyo, shell. If I say E, is the construction of ani. Ani means I. Ani significa yo, ani. And that yod, that yod right there. It means it comes from Ani. That yod viene de Ani, viene de, de yo. So Shelly means mine. Because Shell is property, Shell is the propiedad. Shelly means mine. So Hajeder Shelly is the rune of mine or my room. Hajeder viene siendo como. Ajedel Shelly es mi habitación o mi cuarto. Gadol. What is Gadol means? Gadol means big. Gadol means big. Grande. Ok, this word right here. Gadol. Es grande. So what the whole phrase says. ¿Qué dice toda la frase? Ajedel Shelly Gadol. Mi habitación es grande. Okay. And is, the, the, the word is, or in Spanish is, the verb to be is understandable in the Hebrew. And in the Hebrew, el verbo serio estar se sobreentiende. So we don't use it, serio estar in the Hebrew. We don't use the verb to be in Hebrew. That's why there's, there's nothing that is between here to say is, is big. Okay. So it says the the room of mine is big, but it, it, the is is not there because it's understandable. La palabra aquí dice la habitación o la habitación mía es grande. La palabra es no está porque se, se sobreentiende el verbo sería está. A heder sheli gadol. Repeat after me. A heder I say repeat after me. Ajede Shelly Gadol. Second line. Bajede Shelly Delet Halon Kise Okay, let me break it down. Now it doesn't say ha anymore. But it means, but it says ba. Ya no dice ha, pero dice ba. Ba header. Okay. Ha header. Ba header. Okay. And for the Spanish speakers... Para lo que habla en español, no dice que va a heder, porque si hede ya era. Ok, si, si hede, si va a heder, hede y ya se acabó, no sirve más. Doesn't mean that. No significa eso. Significa va, the, the, the prefix va, el prefijo va, is a combination, es una combinación 
de B, like Bereshit, como dice en Bereshit, en el principio, significa en, la B significa en, B means in, like in the beginning, B, en ha, a combination plus B, en ha, is ba. So, be ha, ba is supposed to be be ha. In the, so this word right here, esta palabra be, ba, right here, ba, es la combinación de be y ha, que significa en la, o en él, ok, entonces en la habitación, aquí dice la habitación, o el cuarto, aquí dice en la habitación, o en el cuarto, ok, so, what it means ba, is not, is not the room now, because before it was the room, now it's in the room, because ba is in the Like in the beginning, Bereshit, but well, now it says Ba. What it means is Baheder in the room. Okay? In the. Right here is only the room. And right here, in the room. Okay? So, Baheder Sheli, you guys know it's of mine, Mio. Baheder Sheli, Delet. Okay? And Delet, if you see number one right here, delet is door, delet is puerta, okay, delet, okay, delet is puerta, halon, halon, number two is what, window, halon is ventana, okay, en esta otra línea, en this line, quise, what is quise? Quise, in this line is what? Chair. Quise significa silla. V, okay, this V right here is a prefix. Este V es un prefijo. V means end. I, okay, V means end. Okay. En español, I. Ok. Shulhan. Shulhan es mesa. Shulhan es table. So what the whole phrase says, starting right here. It says, Baje de in the room, en la habitación, Shelly, in my room, en mi habitación. There is, because remember, verb to be, is, we now use, there is what? Ello hay, que hay? Delet, door, puerta, jalón, we got window, we got, we have the, the, the quise, and, and, shulhan, and we have table. En español, Bajeder en la habitación mía. Tengo una puerta. Tengo la ventana, jalón. Tengo una silla. Y una mesa. Ok. So, right here, they, it, it pretty, it's, it's pretty much simple that it's, it's saying one of each. So it doesn't mention any number, but um, for the Spanish speakers, I have to mention that it's, it's one door, you know, a door, or, okay? That's why I say one, two, three, or, it's only one for of each. Ahí está mencionando que tiene simple lectura, una, una cosa de cada, una, una puerta, una mesa, una silla, una ventana, okay? Okay. Now this line right here. Esta línea ahora. Bajeder. Ok. Same word. La misma palabra. Bajeder. Sefer. 
גדול. ספר גדול. ספר, is a libro, אוקיי? ספר is book, a big book, big, גדול, אוקיי? ספר, so big, in the room, there's a big book, אוקיי? אין הביטשון, hay una, un libro grande, אוקיי? ספר is a libro, ספר is a book, גדול, big, grande. בספר, now you see, using the word ספר, אוקיי, ספר is here, ספר גדול, but now, בספר, what it means? What it means בספר? Means in the, right? It means in the book, אוקיי, en el libro, significa en el libro, בספר, סיפור, What we, what we say that is Sipur, Sipur is, the, is here, Sipur Gadol, we already know what is Gadol means, big, ya sabemos que, es, que Gadol es grande, y Sipur es story, historia, ok, ha mishpacha, ha, question, yes, um, the Gadol is the same word as the Hagadol, muy buena pregunta la gadol es lo mismo que el sacerdote que es el sumo sacerdote o el gran sacerdote ok the same the question um, or the, 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 the word gadol is the same word that we use in the coen gadol ok coen ha gadol the, the big priest let's translate it like that or a high priest, right? the high priest. So it's the same phrase, gadol, grande. Very good. Here, when we say basefer, we say in the book, estamos diciendo en el libro, okay? Sipur, so we have a story, tenemos una historia, gadol. Una historia grande, ¿ok? A big story. Ha, that it means the, ¿ok? Ha mishpacha. Certain, uh, there's, there's also certain rules that if you see a double a, like right here, mishpacha, you can say the first one as o. That's, that's why pretty much you heard mish. Poja. Okay? You heard it pretty much. They said, people say, Mishpoja. Hay una regla de, por ejemplo, aquí hay dos A. Puedes decir, Mishpoja. O puedes decir, como muchas personas pronuncian, principalmente los que nacen. Cuando hay dos A, mencionan una como O, la primera y después A. Mishpoja. Okay, pretty much the Ashkenazim are the ones who says Mishpacha. For Sephardim, um, we say Mishpacha. We say we read we we say it exactly what we read. A Mishpacha lo bacheder. Lo is a negative. Lo is no. So what the friend says is, my family is not in the room. And you see right here in the. Ba, again, like we saw right here, and right here, Ba, and right here, Ba, ok? Lo que vimos aquí, eh, en la traducción, la fa mi familia, o la familia, no está en la habitación, no está en el cuarto, ok? Let me move this. How to move it? Hold on. One second. Oh, there is. Okay. Okay. So the next line. Ha ach, ach. Okay, right here, the number one, what it means, 
brother. Ah is brother. Okay. And ha is the, so the brother. Okay. Lo bached. Lo bached. Ah lo bached. The brother is not in the room. El hermano. Ah es hermano. Ah. El hermano no está en la habitación. Ah lo bajed. And then if Ah is his brother, Ahot is the female. So Ahot is sister. I right hear sister. Ahot. Si Ah es hermano. Ahot es el femenino. Ahot es hermana. Ha Ahot lo bajeder. The sister is not in the room. Ha Ahot lo bajed. Ani. I or me. Ani yo. Bajeder. I am in the room. Okay. Yo estoy en la habitación. Ani bajede. He. He pretty much is because. Porque. He. De. Ajede sheli. Because. It is. The room of mine. Because it's my room. Okay. Porque. He se. Porque. Es mi habitación. La habitación mía. Ok. Aniba Heather. Aniba Heather. I'm, I'm in the room. Because it's my room. Ok. I am in the room. Aniba Heather. Estoy en la habitación porque es mi habitación. And I'm gonna, I have to drive this, this little car right here. All right. So now you got now it's your turn to repeat after me. From here, from this line. Everybody says Bajeder. I say everybody says Bajeder. I I say everybody. You heard? No? Okay, everybody repeat. Bajede. Sefer. Gadol. Ba sefer. Sipur. Gadol. Ha mishpacha. Lo. Bajede. Ha'ach lo bajeder. Ha'achot lo bajeder. Ani bajeder. Y se ha'cheder sheli. Okay. And here is the vocabulary. Okay, Milon is vocabulary. Milon. If you want to take a picture of this, Gadol is big, masculine. If I want to say big female way, I say Gedola. Okay. So, Gadol is masculine, Gadol, but female is Gedola. Okay, I'm pretty much only going to add a hey at the end, but the vowels right here is going, not going to sound like a, but a Gedola. Delet is puerta, is door. Okay. Halon. Tana, 
de silla, chair, shulhan, shulhan es mesa, ok, table, shulhan, tipo, historia, story, tipo, mishpaha, familia, ok, family, ah, hermano, ahot, hermana, ah, brother, ahot, sister. And remember that we said Sheli is mine. If I want to say my brother, I only add a yod at the end. Si quiero decir mi hermano, solo voy a agregar una yod al final. Okay. And it's going to say Ahi. Ahi is mi hermano. Ahi is my brother. Okay. And if I add a yod right here, Ahoti. Ahoti is my sister. So remember, Ani is, is where, the, where that yod comes from. Okay. Ani. Okay. Ani. Then I take this yod. Put it next to it. Ahi, my brother. Ahoti, my sister. Okay, but ah is brother and ahot, sister. Very good, very good, very good. Now let's go. What happened to this? Okay. Good. Some exercises, to reading, and we have got only a couple minutes. So let's read it. Let's read everybody. Right here it says Ba Kita Sheli Kita Sheli and Well we have to for for correct to, to have this like making an answer of is according to the story. So if you can see that Mishpocha, Bakita Sheli, okay, then the, the, the answer should be Mishpocha, okay, because we weren't talking about Mora, Mora is teacher, so we didn't talk about a teacher, we were talking about Mishpocha, right here, relating to the story, Bakita Sheli. Um, actually, Kita is classroom, okay? Kita is classroom. And we were talking about Heather. I make a mistake because we were talking about Heather, right? Heather Shelley. But Heather Shelley, what we have by Heather Shelley? We don't have a sukkah. Right here we read, for that we have to read the whole, um, the, the, the whole chapter to see exactly, um, to, to respond to these this questions. But I give you a, a clue. Right here, it says sukkah. Right? And right here it says shulhan. Then bacheder, sheli. Yeshli, what? Shulhan. But anyways, my time is off. We're going to return next week. Nos vemos la próxima semana. Besar Hashem. Okay? Shalom, shalom. And if you want to get deep and deeper in this, Wednesdays and Thursday at 8 o'clock we have Hebrew class. So I see you guys uh, during the week. Shalom. Shalom. This is Messianic Rabbi Andrew Dinnerman. I would personally like to thank you for tuning in to the Remnants Call each and every week. You can listen to the full message on our website, bethgoyim.org. If you have drawn closer to the King of Kings, learned more about Him today, we are blessed. If you are blessed by these messages, please consider a donation to our ministry. You can go to our website, bethgoyim.org. That's B-E-T-H-G-O-Y-I-M.org. And click on the Donate button. You do not have to have a PayPal account to donate. All you need is a debit card. Once again, thank you very much for listening to
the remnants call. If you have not taken your first steps to be born again, just ask God's help. Remember, it's His loving grace that has come to find you. No one is worthy or able to reach God, but God can reach us, and He's reaching out to you now. Just open your heart and let Him in. His arms are open, and the blessing of salvation and eternal life are waiting for you. Don't let it wait any longer. you and keep you. May the Lord lift his face to shine upon you. May the Lord be gracious unto you and give you his shalom. Shalom. My name is Messianic Rabbi Andrew Dinnerman, and I invite you to come to visit our congregation. If you are in the tri-state area, come out and visit with us on Shabbat. We are a congregation of Jews and Gentiles living as one in the Messiah Yeshua. BGMC is a place of true worship. The focus never wanders from the Hebraic roots of our faith. Beth Goyim is rooted in the Word of God from Bereshit through to the book of Revelation. Messiah's strong words against man-made tradition are carefully recorded in Matthew 7. That is the reason we only follow the straight-up instructions found in Scripture. Truly, the way, the truth, and the life. If you're looking for a deeper walk with Adonai, come out for our Tuesday evening Bible study called Messianic Torah Time. Come, spend the day with us on any Shabbat. We start at 11 a.m. with the sound of the ancient Hebrew shofar. Next, we offer our King praise and worship in English, Hebrew, and Spanish. After worship, we review the headlines in the previous week's news from around the globe, especially News from the Holy Land, Israel. We don't just list the news headlines as current events, but we comb through the scriptures searching for clues to understand what they mean and then to help pinpoint prophetically our current position on Adonai's clock. After digesting all that modern information, we leave the world behind as we journey with our Adonai deep into his eternal word, not with just one or two scriptures, but usually seven or more scriptures. The spiritual nourishment and the richness of his kingdom become accessible to the ones who share this special time and seek them out. The day does not end there. Because Shabbat is so special to him, there is always so much more that our king desires to share. So instead of separating and leaving, we stay together as a family for potluck lunch and an afternoon study of our king's word. We close this Shabbat together with the reading of the New Week's parasha, That's the Torah portion. Even after those blessings, many of us just can't get enough. So the members bring prepared homemade foods to share while we all enjoy an uplifting movie together. If all that information is not quite enough, you can check out our website where you will find over 200 video teachings and Biblical Holy Day studies. Under Messianic Torah Time, the Hebrew Roots button, you'll discover free studies on many, many different topics, including PowerPoint slide presentations. If Beth Goyim sounds like a place you'd love to visit, but you live outside the tri-state area, there is still a way to connect with us. We stream live on the internet on Tuesday, Thursday, and Shabbat. The website is www.bethgoyim.org. That's B-E-T-H-G-O-Y-I-M.org. Our phone number is 973-338-7800 or 978-2-YESHUA. That's 978, the number 2, Yeshua. Shalom.